Let me show you how to transform this to this. You do not need any rising time. Fry right away and this is so soft and delicious. So guys, right here I have my overripe plantains. I know many of you have this type of plantains at home and when you fry it, it is so soft and mushy but do not throw it away because I'm going to show you how to make something super delicious and tasty. You want to start off by peeling that and we are going to go ahead to slice it inside our blender. After slicing, add in some milk, vanilla extract for flavor, of course. You want to add in two large eggs. Bring in some melted butter. Do not miss this part, okay? The butter is going to make it super, super flavorful. Now, I'll be adding in two tablespoons of brown sugar. I put two tablespoons because my plantain is really, really sweet because it's overripe. In most cases, I usually fry it without sugar. But brown sugar is going to give it a really good flavor. Any sweetener is going to work as well. Transfer that into a bowl. Add in two cups of all-purpose flour. Now bring in some baking powder, that's 2 teaspoons of baking powder and I'll be using half teaspoon of salt. Of course, adding some nutmeg for extra kick of a beautiful flavor. You want to go ahead and mix that until everything turns out with a beautiful consistency just like this. Now go ahead in a pot of hot oil, you want to deep fry right away. You do not need to let it rise, okay? Fry right away. While you're frying, you want to stir from time to time so everything is going to have a beautiful and uniform color a golden color of course just like this so go ahead and stir when you achieve this color you can remove then place on an absorbent paper and you can serve right away or you serve when cold guys when i make this snack at home <laughs> it doesn't stay for up to a day because if you eat one you're gonna go for another it is so soft very very soft and melt in your mouth sweet everything you can ask for and one thing i love it is because when it stays overnight at room temperature it doesn't get hard the more it stays at room temperature the more it becomes softer so it can stay at room temperature for about two days that you can put in the refrigerator see how soft that is looking i, I told you guys if you eat one you're definitely good to <laughs> gonna go for another like me just now thank you so much for watching and to meet again bye